How do I stay consistent with workouts? What happens when I fall off track? In this video, I'll go over the three steps to staying consistent when it comes to your health and your workout routine. So let's go ahead and get to it. What is up everybody? It's your boy, the Millennial Health Coach, where I help you conquer your mind, master your health, and grow to achieve your highest potential. So if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe below. So the question of the day is, how do I stay consistent when it comes to my workouts or staying healthy? And this is a good question because, you know, I definitely understand where you're coming from. I, you know, you have friends coming into town, you want to go out to dinner, you have a vacation coming up. There's a lot of things that can get you off of that consistent health track and take you off that routine. And for this reason, I went ahead and put three steps together to how you can actually conquer this and make sure you stay consistent. Step number one is think about your triggers. Are you that type of person that drinks a ton at brunch? Or maybe you're the type of person who snacks a lot when they're traveling and they're like going to always fast food places, all that. Think about what are your triggers? What is it that makes you, you know, what are your temptations? For me, I'm not gonna lie, it's powdered donuts. I love powdered donuts. That actually leads me to step two, plan ahead of time. It goes to say the regular quote, if you fail to prepare, you prepare to fail. If you know your triggers ahead of time, think about what is something that you could do to prevent that trigger from happening or maybe that you can adjust your mindset. For example, let's say that you know you like to drink a ton at brunch, right? You're that type of person who's like, yo, bottles, sangria, margaritas, bring them my way. If that's gonna be you. I say this, limit yourself. You're like, all right, I know I'm gonna go into this environment. Maybe I can get something super healthy on the food end. Now I'm not saying go ahead and indulge and have six or seven drinks. You still wanna be mindful of that and have less, but to kind of compensate for it, try to eat a healthier meal. Try to eat a meal full of protein, vegetables, and then when you're already making that subconscious mindset shift, like I need to be healthy eating, you're actually gonna be making healthier choices when it comes to drinking as well. So you gotta make sure you prepare ahead of time. So in my case for the powdered donuts, what I like to do to prepare ahead of time is to actually bring my own snacks. Like if I'm traveling and I'm like, all right, I know if I stop at a gas station, I see them powdered donuts, it's over. What I'll go ahead and do is bring my own fruits. I'm a big like Clementine grapes fan. If I just need something sweet in my like, you know, on my taste buds, I just phew, reach in my bag, boom, get the fruit out. And then step number three is just be mindful of it. I'm not saying be super strict, just be mindful of the decisions that you're making. At the end of the day, you know what's good for you. You know what's healthy, you know what's not healthy. Go in with the mindset saying, hey look, I wanna be healthy. I wanna make changes in my body, in my life, so I need to make the right decisions. Just kind of coming into it, just pumping yourself up and you're like, yo, I'm about to be healthy. And I know that sounds weird, but like if you're really trying to like look good for like the summertime, trying to look good for that spouse, trying to fit in that shirt, trying to fit in that dress, that needs to be one of your top priorities. So go into it and be like, yo, this is my mission. This is my vision for myself. This is what I'm gonna achieve. That's really it. So I hope this video was super helpful for you. If it was, feel free to put in the comment box below, helpful. And before you head out, I do wanna go ahead and tell you something. If you're that person who's traveling a lot or you like to go on vacations, but you wanna to try to stay healthy on it, I actually have something that's just for you. So I have a book linked in the description box below, totally free called Millennials No Excuses, the guide to fitness and nutrition no matter the location, where I give a nutrition deep dive, a workout that you can do in your hotel room without any weights, but then also a workout you can do if you do have a hotel gym. So go ahead and check it out. It's in the description box below. It's got to be super helpful for you. So I'll catch you all the next video. You already know, embrace the hype. Hold on one second. Did you check out this video? How about this video? And I already know if you haven't already, you need to make sure you subscribe. All right. I'll catch y'all next time. See you later.